So what do jazz, comic books, and the Canadian indie music scene have in common? All three have historically, at times, received greater acclaim across the pond before they broke here at home. That was certainly the case for acts like Arcade Fire and Broken Social Scene. And my next guest, Kate Rogers, the Toronto-born singer-songwriter, grew up bi-continental, traveling back and forth between Canada and the UK because of her British mother and her Canadian father. She studied at the Royal Conservatory of Music and attended Fashion Design College in Canada before turning her attention full-time to music. After stints of backing up artists and collaborating on projects for UK indie Grand Central Records, she released her debut album of original material 2004's Saint Eustacia to great critical reviews in the British press. She followed up with 2005's Seconds, a collection of cover material. Back from their UK tour, Kate Rogers and the Kate Rogers Band are our Friday Live guests here in Q. Hello to you all. Hello. Welcome home, Kate. Thank you. Yeah, fresh off the plane. Bicontinental. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds pretty impressive. It That's... does. It sounds... Uh, wouldn't you rather be bicontinental? It sounds like you'd have a martini in your uh, yeah. hand. Yeah, two lives. Well, it's great. When, when described as... How do I... Is it Saint... How do I say that? Saint Eustatia. It is Saint Eustatia. Yeah. I realize uh, as you say those, I sound very French and I'm not. Beauregard and Saint yeah. Eustatia. Well, you're... Not on purpose. You're endorsing various parts of your uh, Canadiana. You're going to play a song for us now. Is it, is it a new song or... It is a new song, yes. It's a new song from, from the upcoming album called Stealing From You. Okay, and just before you play Stealing Stealing From Me? <laughs> Stealing From You, Stealing, Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't make the hubris level growing. I didn't mean to make it about me. It's Stealing From You is the name of the song. It but is, yes. Before you, just before you play it, can, can you uh, introduce the humans who've joined you? I certainly can. Right. Over here to my right on the on the piano, Mr. Tom Howell. To my very close right, Aaron Parton. I like that the band members are saying hello to each other as yeah. you introduce them. <laughs> hey, hey. Tom, Aaron, yes. <laughs> we haven't spent much time together. <laughs> uh, the, Mr. David Blue Dunlap on the electric. And over there on the snare, potato and egg is uh, Josh Van Tassel. Fantastic. You're Kate Rogers, and together you guys are Kate Rogers. Uh, the Kate Rogers Band. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. I'm made up of many, many people. <laughs> All right. Stealing from You, brand new song from the Kate Rogers Band, live in Studio Q.
Nicely done, performing live in Studio Q. That's the Kate Rogers Band. The song "Stealing from You" from their forthcoming record, Beauregard. It doesn't he, I mean? Didn't even sound. It sounded like a studio recording there. It sounded really nice. Oh, well, Nicely done. You. Nice work on the snare, the one-handed uh, snare work there, David. Uh, John. 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 Josh. <laughs> yeah, he, he's used to I'm, okay. I'm sorry, Josh. <laughs> Great work, anyway, on on the drums. And I should mention the the, the man tinkling the piano is very handily uh, uh, kind of behind me. Is Tom Howell? Uh, CBC listeners may recognize him as the word nerd. Oh yeah. From and sometimes why? Uh, Kate Rogers Band. Great to have you here. We're going to chat. We're going to hear more from you in the coming uh, hour and a half. Thanks for being here. Oh, thank you. And by the way, myspace.com slash Kate Rogers Band. If you're following along at home or driving and uh, multitasking, uh, myspace.com slash Kate Rogers Band. <laughs> 